time I stood in this ring with a microphone in my hands, it was eight days after SummerSlam. Eight days after getting beaten by Brock Lesnar, eight days after he broke my arm for the second time in two months. I stood in this ring and I told you I, I thought I might be done. I said I thought it might be over. I got all emotional, I got choked up. And the thing was, I wasn't sure when it was over if I was trying that hard to convince you or trying that hard to convince me. Because the second that cast was off, I was back in the gym, training like always, tearing it up, busting my ass, but with no real goal in mind. Yeah, I was doing my, J my day job as the COO, wearing a suit. I even cut my hair. But training every day. And a few months later, I found myself in the best shape I'd been in in years. And I was just waiting, waiting for a reason. Then I found myself sitting next to a hospital bed, looking at an old man who had just got done having hip surgery. And the thing is, that, that old man put aside the fact that he's the guy that created all of this, that he's the reason we're all here. Put aside the fact that his daughter, my wife, sat crying at that bedside. Put aside the fact that my kids, his grandkids, sat there crying at bedside. I sat there with a smile inside because I just found my reason. And all I needed was the opportunity. So when that same crazy ass old man decided to get up out of that bed, come and stand in this ring and challenge Paul Heyman to a fight. And Paul Heyman did what he does and he turned to Brock Lesnar. I was ready. And Brock Lesnar, if you think for one second that we were done after SummerSlam, reach up on top of your head and feel those 12 staples and know that we were just getting started. I don't think it takes a rocket scientist to figure out why I'm standing in this ring here today. Five weeks. Five weeks from the big dance. Here we go, Brock. I'm calling you out. I know you're the guy that usually stands in this ring and does the destruction, but last week I split you wide open. So here we go. WrestleMania, let's finish what we started. You and I, because I'm back. The ass kicker is back. The king of kings is back. The game is back. And he's calling you out for WrestleMania. So what's it gonna be, Brock? Are you gonna show up at WrestleMania? Are you gonna show up and fight? Or are you just gonna sit there and bleed.